now that you've got access to the place, see what you can do about opening a line for me to slice in remotely.
This is my ship. Think you could just walk on in and be left alive? Coruscant, Droman Kaas, Corellia. The names are all encoded, but breaking through that is only a matter of time. I'm going to get started right away. Great work. You should hurry back. Despite what we overheard earlier, the Revanites could show up at any moment to try and help their allies. Besides, I think we've earned a bit of a celebration. I'll be back in no time. Perfect. Welcome back. You've achieved more in your short time here than we ever thought possible. You should be proud. That's kind of you to say. Perhaps working together like this means there's hope for a more peaceful future. Perhaps so. I also said we should stop for decorations on the way. Now the party's terrible and it's our fault as much as theirs. Hey. Slicing the Nova Blade files is slow going, but I've already found more references to this torch person that Margok and Revan were talking about. She definitely heads up a group of Mandalorians based here on Rishi. They were allied with the Revanites, but then broke ties. And not on good terms. If we can find Torch and get her talking, she might give us some good intel. Maybe even help us take the Revanites on. I've fought my share of Mandalorians. It would be nice to have some on our side for a change. Agreed. It looks like Torch and her crew control their own island not far from here. Think you could head over and see what she has to say? I'll contact you once I've found Torch. Let me know as soon as you pull anything else out of the Nova Blade files. You got it. Good luck. <laughs> Everything you just heard, it's important. Remember it. But it can wait a little while. There's something I want you to see. Who's there? Follow your feelings and you'll find it. I grew up here, you know, and I mean here, this house, not just Rishi. Of course, I was young when the Jedi found me. Don't remember much more than the walls, a blanket and a few friendly faces. Master Orgas. But it seemed as good a place as any to visit one last time. Hello, Padawan. Got time for a final lesson from an old friend? It's good to see you, Master. Any lesson you have to share, you know I'll listen. Whether you'll act on it is something else, hmm? It's good to see you, too. Since you set out to defeat the Emperor, you've been fighting almost non-stop. You've been waist-deep in dirt and fear and blood. Since the Emperor's fall, the war has only gotten uglier. And there are dark times coming for the galaxy and for you. You've sensed what's to come? Just a little. And I'm worried you'll forget why you're fighting. Defending the Republic, vanquishing the Sith, those are tools a Jedi uses in the service of life. 
of people, not ends unto themselves. When I fight, I'm fighting to preserve life, not destroy it. I serve the Force, and the Force is peace. I don't doubt you, but when's the last time you felt connected to that peace? We're going to take a little time, help the people of Rishi. Folks eking out a living good and bad, living in fear of guns and pirates. You're going to make their lives better, as only you can. You're going to feel why you're a Jedi. I can think of no better way to spend my time here. Where do we begin? There are a lot of people without homes on Rishi. Those people are catching Tamaman fever. On Corellia, they cure it for free. Here, no one much cares. No one but you. Your doc can treat a person in minutes. You've got a ship packed with food and medicine. I understand. Yes, you do. No Sith Lords, no ancient evils this time. Just doing a bit of good. Take care. <laughs> Trust for strangers on Rishi. Can you blame them? Thank you. 